we sold our flat in London and bought this and still had change. Glorious Scotland. This is one of my favourite places on earth. I've often imagined what it would be like to bring my own family here and open a boutique hotel. It's the Scottish dream. Well, I'm coming to meet a family who've done just that. They've moved from Croydon in South London. They bought a dilapidated hotel here in the Highlands on the border of the Cairngorms National Park. After getting married in 2015, Jade and Alice are turning their backs on the big city to start a brand new life in the country. They both had high paying jobs in London, Jade in PR and Alice in finance, but they felt trapped on the treadmill. It's the perfect place for opportunity, but it's at what cost? Life in London was very repetitive. Do the same thing every day. I found it very tiresome after a while. Being wage slaves didn't leave much time to enjoy their lives together outside of work. We didn't see much of each other, and I think, you know, there was that sort of sense that we were these sort of, you know, sh ships in the night. And all their hard work could only buy them a cramped flat in Croydon. Our old flat was, was, was tiny. It was like 527 square feet, two dogs and two human beings. It was pretty chaotic. After tying the knot, they've bravely decided to make a new life far away from the London rat race. Alice, who's Scottish on her mother's side, knows just where she wants to be. My father was in the army, so we travelled a lot. I think Scotland and seeing my grandparents was probably the one uh, constant home that I saw throughout my childhood. The second thing was I was on a mission to find something that both Jade and I could do. They searched for eight months before finding their dream business, a small country hotel by a beautiful loch. This project allows us to spend more time together. I'm hoping it is also going to give us the work-life balance that we're looking for, being outside, walking our dogs, exploring where we live. I want it to allow us to enjoy life. So they've traded in a foot on the London property ladder and secure well-paid jobs for this, an ancient rundown hotel in the heart of the countryside. We sold our flat in London and bought this and still had change. The hotel is 500 miles from London in the wilds of the Scottish Highlands. The nearest town is Pitt Lochry, over 10 miles away. The hotel has six guest bedrooms and staff living quarters, as well as a restaurant and a bar that sits 40 people. But it's been empty for two years. You guys bought a hotel? Yeah. Don't say it too much, because it's a bit scary. <laughs> 